Why can't you marry your daddy? Do you mean why can't little girls marry their daddies? Yes. Do you want to marry daddy? Can I? He's already married to me. He's taken. But if you don't want him... Someday when you're older like mommy, you can marry a nice man like daddy. X-ray 1, that's the target's wife arriving home with the two children. From X-ray 1, target's wife arriving home with the two children. Spectre's qualifications as a counsellor are for real. They were pretty thoroughly checked out when he was first employed by the local authority. Two main things to follow up on. Spectre had been counselling a married couple, James and Elizabeth Tyler. Their son died of meningitis, 10 years old. James Tyler, Jimmy, is well known to us. It seems that James, following the death of his son, became a bit free with his fists, as far as Liz was concerned. Spectre advised Liz to report him to the domestic violence unit. She was reluctant. James was out of prison on license. Anything like that would put him back inside. Spectre was persuasive. Liz made the call. She's now in a woman's refuge in Bangor somewhere. Is James back in prison? Out on bail. Tagged with curfew conditions. Pay her a visit. Don't let anyone else see that address. No, ma'am. Spectre had a run-in with James Tyler about an unscheduled house call he made on Liz when she was home alone. Chandler and his boss had occasion to reprimand Spectre. This was on the day of the Joe Brawley murder. Spectre behaved bizarrely, walked out, never came back, disappeared. Behaved bizarrely? Yes. How? How? That's what I said. That's what I said. What? What? What are you doing? I'm doing what he did. What are you doing? I see. Mirroring. <laughs> 